Hi, it is July 23rd, 2019. I'm Jacqueline Ritchie Krieger, and I am standing in the space where I'm gonna build the labyrinth in honor of my parents' 70th birthdays. You know, I, I feel the labyrinths, they connect you to people from yesteryear and people that are to come. And it's like just a sacred pathway where everybody can be mindful of their life and the life we share together. Never built a labyrinth before, but I really have been experiencing this mesa top since childhood. Whew, the work has begun. Uh, I, my hands are even kind of shaking. I've been hoeing. These labyrinths, they don't build themselves on <laughs> this uh, earth. I just need to prepare the ground. But I, I already know that it's worth it. And uh, this is a, a mission that I am on to complete this project and just really honor the land that I grew up on and multiple generations of my family. You know, plants that are gonna need to be removed and rocks that I'm starting to pile up here. And I just need this, you know, to clear, clear the space so I can even um, make the design and work. And I feel like it's, since it is like super Texas summer heat, I'm gonna need to just do this in spurts. Um, but it's really beautiful just hearing the the animals and the wind blowing through the grasses and the sky is gorgeous. Just cleared uh, more of the land, more of the grass. I mean, this whole thing is so symbolic. So uh, you know, you've got to clear the space in your life, in your heart in your body, it's, it's a cleanse. Uh, and we need to remove the things that aren't helpful on our pathway so that we can even get to our pathway and get on with things in the winding labyrinth of life. The Mesa. The space is growing. Here we go. I'm wondering if I want to incorporate this giant pile of wood chips my parents have here to just put on top of the ground covering see if it gives it a nice little squish 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 feeling and to keep the grasses from growing I'm laying the mulch down up here Ooh, I'm about a third of the way through it's pretty slow moving since I'm carrying it bucket by bucket your thoughts <laughs> or deep breaths. Yeah. Deep thoughts, deep breaths. You know, it's my childhood out here. <laughs> you know. Oh, and I'll cry too. Oh. <laughs> Even if it just seems like, you know, just an art project or whatever, but it's so much more than that. It meant a lot to me to be here. The labyrinth is coming along. I think I've really created the space for it. The mulch is all on the ground and my next step is to really just start measuring and spray painting around the design. So the scene is set.
I'm collecting stones and when it becomes the part of the night where I'm like cow patty or rock it's time to go home it actually is starting to look like a labyrinth ah! <laughs> and there's a train stopped back here so I'm just listening to the sounds of the train. I think it is about the winding pathway of life. And when you're walking the labyrinth, you just kind of get to surrender to the pathway. And then I'm, it, it symbolizes life. And so then I'm starting to reflect and think about my life and be like, oh, this was a, a winding pathway. Or, oh, I'm glad I picked up this skill or met this person even when you think you're reaching like oh this is a twist or a turn or uh, a, a narrow pathway we have those in life and so we get to keep moving forward and find where the pathway leads us and as I get older I'm seeing more puzzle pieces coming together of like oh that may be why I was interested in this decades ago but then it, it, things start coming full circle and then eventually you end up in the center of the labyrinth. My labyrinth plans! <laughs> they just flew away. Oh my gosh, this is so interesting. Uh, I did not think a piece of paper would fly that high and that far away. <laughs> the literal map to the labyrinth. It's like being set free. It's like, okay, you built this thing. Peace. On to the next person. I just rounded the edges here, cleared out the center space of all the miscellaneous rocks I've been using throughout the process. This uh, marking the center pathway was interesting, interesting process. I waited till the end to do that for whatever reason. Clear of poles and rocks and various debris as it's been my staging ground and mom and dad haven't seen it yet so this will be a really fun 70th birthday reveal. The labyrinth is complete! Ah! <laughs> this is so amazing, I'm so excited. So. Here it is. Ooh, sunny. It works. <laughs> All the lines line up. Oh my goodness, what a journey. What a labyrinth. Here's this heart in the center. on the road. <laughs> we got off the labyrinth, girl. <laughs> She's on her own pathway. So I'm gonna fix your shoes. Yeah, all the materials are free. Exactly. All from ah. the land. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Oh no, my picture. Right, it's 70 years. 70!